gamers! I am back and today I'll be showcasing my kitchen in my Hello Kitty Cafe. This is a request from Cheska May. Hi Cheska May and thank you for suggesting this video. As you guys know, I am now max level in this game. I've been max level for a few months now, I believe. And you can see all this stuff in here. So my kitchen is fully furnished for all the stuff you can see and get in this game. So first things first, this is what you're going to be see before you enter the kitchen. I separate them with a wall because I don't like seeing them. I feel like it's too messy. I'm not sure. But I like my kitchen to be separated and then I keep the original floor just because I like how clean looking it is. And then all the stuff is in here. The coffee area is right here. And the juice area is on the other side. Okay, so mostly drinks are on this wall, as you guys can see. There you go. And then the pickup counter is here. And then the order counter is here. I only put one of each because I have another one on the second floor. And then on the other side is all of these counters here. You guys can be able to go see it now. There you go. Easy for them to go pick up everything they needed. And then I just make it a uh, facing that way. Uh, so it's covered and no mosquito or flies getting them so they are now getting ready to go pick something right you guys gonna go pick something no okay so this is what my first uh, floor a uh, kitchen looks uh, like let me know in the comments down below what you guys uh, think a lot cleaner right and then there's a uh, plenty of room for you guys to walk around and for your npcs to walk around and not a bump to each other okay let's go ahead and get to our second floor so you guys can see what I have put in there. Okay, a second floor is pouring a them. So I get another counter over here and another pickup counter over here. And then the bar a table over here and just a small stuff in here that did not a fit on my first a floor. So these are whatever this is. Ooh, this is cotton candy, cupcake, and then whatever that is. And then I just uh, put the ice cream in the front of a pouring wall. If you guys are wondering what this is, that is a pouring wall. Okay, and then on the other side, we got all our oven and some other counters or donut or croissant, whatever that is. And then since they did not uh, fit in all this area here, I just added some more over on this uh, side. It's still enough area for them to walk around and not bump up to each other and make it looks like it's a neat area, right? And then I added the bar around it uh, so you guys can see and look to the NPC. So it's perfect if you guys are role playing with friends and family are just on your own and make uh, sure you are enjoying it making you feel like it is like in real world so you guys there you go guys all right uh, let me know in the comments down below what you guys uh, think of my kitchen design i would love to hear you guys thoughts and ideas and if you guys would like to change anything what is your suggestion? I am open for all the suggestions and comments from you guys. Again, uh, thank you, Cheska, for suggesting this video. And with that, I said thank you guys uh, for watching. Remember to subscribe to Yoni J. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.